Hello everybody and welcome to a game that had me quite curious. Stories, the Path of Destinies. All I know about this game is that you apparently make choices. It's not un it's not unlike a telltale game, but apparently you can make up your own story. Something or something similar. Something to that effect. Uh, I don't know much else about it, but let's get right into it. Ooh, pretty. Once upon a time. Oh hello. The infamous jumping brother, right into it. Renardo plundered the floating isles. Renardo. Then his mother called him to her deathbed. Swear to me that you won't die on the gallows. She rasped. Reluctantly, he swore. And he mm. whiled away his days at home with music, cards, and wine. That okay. The emperor had changed. Had changed. Good once, War shy, has changed. Humble toad. He built universities. Then people started whispering about mass graves in the woods. Okay. Midnight rituals. Victims screaming. The Imperial Ravens would round up entire villages. And no one ever returned. All right. The Ravens had come to Ubar scouting for ancient books said to be of great power. But the librarians had hidden the books. So they'd burnt the librarians. The oh, citizens seems logical. Had driven them off. I like the, the art design of this game. Dropships. The kid had fled with one of those books. He was brave and dumb and wanted to join the rebellion. Brave, dumb. Renato well, I mean, that's what the rebellion's looking for. Protect him. Okay. All right. So I like this game. Doesn't waste any time. With its storytelling, just jumps right into it as soon as you click new game. Not even a loading screen. Except for the loading screen that's here right now. This game is running on Unreal 4, I think. And for whatever reason. I don't know. I thought this game had like a... It looked like this game had a relatively simplistic art style. So I'm not sure if it's just some sort of secret that they're just the using to oh hello watching his city burn sorry kid Renato told the kid look if we give them the book they leave you alone okay my mother died for this book I promised her I'd protect you oh damn it the kid had run off with the book of course okay so Renato had to run after him so where is what is the story part of this okay this looks Okay, this looks interesting enough. Current objective, protect Peter. Alright. Wow, this game is very colorful. The two ravens were staring at the kid like he was their dinner. Okay. Which probably was... This actually kind of reminds me of, um... Hey, games like said. Bastion and Transistor. Pick on someone as ugly at as least you. in terms of storytelling. Didn't come out right. Where there's, al the where there's always the a... Uh, called and rushed at him. Where there's always a well, where there's always a narrator speaking, you know, there's always someone telling you what's going on. At least for the most part. When the enemy's about to attack, okay. Come on. Nope. Oh my. Is it left? Um, is it toward them? Oh, it's toward them. Okay, that makes more sense. Oh, wow, that's actually really cool. Okay, now that I got the hang of it, untouchable. Okay, oh man. A dropship flew overhead. Alright, oh god, I only have 20 health. Noticed him. The kid. Is, a, is a baby rabbit called a kid? No, that's a, um... A donkey? Some sort of animal. There's a kid. Hold, wait. Oh, we should probably be reading this. Hold square to grab, hold L to aim. Okay. <laughs> okay, just push it right off the cliff. Don't even bother with swordplay. Boop. And off you go. For crows, they don't fly very well. Oh, right. The gate of heroes. Okay. Someone's idea of a joke. Making the Skyship Docks a gated community. You needed a hero's sword to open it. And the kid 
was on the other side of the gate. How would you get over there without the key? Promise me you'll take the book to the rebels, or I'm gonna steal your ship. Oh. I'm not taking the damn book anywhere, and neither are you. Try and stop me, laughed the kid. I bet you don't even have a hero sword. And with that, what kind of insult is that? That's a very specific away. insult, considering the narrator to also the just kid. talked about it. He was an idiot, but he had guts. Where was Renata going to get a hero sword? Probably from this chest right here. Or oh, and wind essence. Okay. That sounds about right. I'll need a workshop though. Oh, I wonder where I'll find one of those. Let's see. Perfect. Oh, this is cool. Sword crafting. This is sword crafting. Here you can craft. Blah blah. Oh my goodness! So many. Just I don't. Yes. A hero sword. There we go. D. Cool. All right. So now we have our hero sword, which looks strikingly like the cloud buster or the whatever the buster sword this from uh, what got for settling down FF7, and finding people except to smaller. Care the kid's mum had been a swell cook, and she'd laughed at Renato's jokes. Oh, it's a keyblade, essentially. And the ravens had come to burn her. Except, you know, it actually and she'd made acts him as a key. To protect the kid. But she never told him where the book was. Just the kid. He okay. came up to a ledge. It was too far to jump. I get it. Okay, this one at least makes sense, because he's a rabbit. And there was he can just jump high. Giggling at him. How'd you get across? He asked the kid. Where'd you find a hook? This is like I just hopped? a storybook. I love it. Said the kid. I love the art style of the character Why portraits. They look kid. awesome. Hey, look out behind you! Cute, said Renato. No, seriously. Oh, There's ladies. actually something behind you. And... Okay. Oh, man, this is... Com I like how the combat's a little cinematic, it seems. It was time to talk some sense into the kid. Hook his way across the ledge and chase the kid down. Wait, hook my the thing way. Was, he hadn't used his hook since he'd retired. He'd done it. Maybe if he meditated at that altar there, he'd remember his old skills. Sounds like the narrator knows something we don't know. Oh, this is cool. Oh, this is awesome. Okay, so skill info. You have one skill point to spend. Yeah, yeah, go and buy the. It was starting skill. to come back to him. Something you've never. You know nothing, forgot. Arctic Fox. Are we in Arctic Fox? We don't look. We're not white. The more he fought, the more he'd probably remember. Okay, so. The more I'd probably remember. Oh, okay, so just triangle, just to use the hook shot. That's not too bad. Oh, this is really cool. It's all glowy and magical. And it's and there apparently the super easy to there. use. She was the fastest ship he'd ever known. All she right. could do the Kester run in twelve furlongs. Oh, so the salesman told him. What's and what's a, what's a furlong? The kid was about to walk into an ambush. Stop! What? He shouted. I'm not giving you the book. Okay. Shouted the kid, and took off. No, oh. Peter. But the kid but ran. Why do we want the book again? And a goggler nailed him with its ivy. Okay. Oh, what the fu Oh, he's just dead. Okay, I guess that works. Can we just attack this? Oh, no, yes? Wait, oh, it wasn't a ro Oh, I was dead. Okay. Okay, let's try that one more time. That was embarrassing. I thought I had him, though. Like, what did he do to me that... The book was unburned. Oh, he's dead already, okay. Next to it were the buckles from the kid's shoes. And a kid-sized pile of ashes. A kid-sized pile of ashes. And he lied and told the kid he'd take the book to the rebels. The kid would be alive now. Really pissed off and betrayed, but alive. Oh, damn it. Renato picked up the book. Okay. He couldn't let the Empire have it now. He was going to have to get it out of there. He'd be a wanted man. Probably have to join the rebellion just to have a place to dock. Well, he'd hated home life anyway. Can we run through the? Oh, we can't. We can't interrupt the. Uh, we can't interrupt. We can't move around the ash pile. That sucks. Oh, well. I do love that glimmer that you get whenever you swing your sword. Like, look at that. It's so bright. Oh, I was enjoying that. What was the big deal about this book anyway? 
that uh, you're you asking me. I want to know what the deal is with this book too. Why did the screen looks dirty? All that had been years ago. How many? The war was a blur, and now three Raven scout ships were chasing him. Okay. Where are you running, rebel? Called the Raven captain over the loud hailer. Oh, Renato right. Could see them cranking up their catapults. Just going out for milk? Renato yelled back. <laughs> Where can you run? Laughed the raven horribly. Okay, Far now him, I want to know what's, was what's going on with this. The dark cloud above its island was thousands of Imperial ships. The fleet was doing a thorough job. Okay. Take us to the rebel base and we'll spare your life. It called. Man, this narrator's the doing my job. Rigged rebel fleet was only a few He's doing voices days. and everything. Beyond that were only the pillars of heaven. Sea of he's got voices, he's got jokes. Tornadoes. The rebellion was out of time. Unless Renato could bring a game changer. What is that game Maybe changer? He could. Renato had found out where he could find the pieces of the Sky Ripper. The legendary weapon that had exiled the lost gods. Okay. Surely a legendary weapon could win the final battle. On the other hand. His old friend Lapino had sent Renato a desperate oh. message saying he had a brilliant scheme to save the rebellion. If Renato could only rescue him, Renato Ooh. dived the farfarer towards the abyss. As he felt the heat of the jet stream, the raven ships peeled off. Not I assume, stable enough to follow him down there. I assume these are, now, this is a choice we get to, to make. Choose. Lapino or the Sky Ripper. Oh man, I like the sound of that Sky Ripper. Okay, so oh oh that's so cool. Okay, so this is the story that we make for ourselves. An ancient artifact defeated the lost gods. It would indeed be a game changer, though it would split into too many wait, into two pieces many years ago. Okay, so just rebuild it by getting its armature. Even though Lupino wasn't anyone he could consider a game changer, he could come up with some hairbrain hairbrain schemes, maybe rescuing him was worth it. Well, let's do Let's do the Sky Ripper. Every child knew about the Sky Ripper. The Transcendent Emperor had buried its pieces. What could have brought them to light? Oh, this is cool. This Emperor, Isengrim III, had once been kind, but he'd gone mad. And now he was conducting secret, obscene rituals to bring back the lost gods. Okay. Oh, and okay. So, th okay, this is all time back then. Summoned the long lost components of the legendary weapon out of the deep places of the earth. This would make a cool playing card. more than Renata could fathom. But if he could find like a, a king legendary weapon, something. he would use it. Okay. Wow. Um, unlike Telltale, it seems like this game's choices are going to have some sort of bigger impact. immediate An immediate impact, anyway. I like this. This is really As cool. As you set foot in the island. Hold on. Can we pause? Okay. Uh, I'm going to end this episode here, but uh, if you guys like this, be sure to leave a like, comment, subscribe, and uh, let's just see where this story takes us in the next video. And I will see you guys there. Bye.